it's December 17th for like one more minute. I'm going to read from the daily inspirations for women, seasons for a woman's life. Winter is written by Margaret Sill. From December to March, there are for many of us three gardens. The garden outdoors. The garden of pots and bowls in the house, and the garden of the mind's eye. That quote is from Catherine S. White, and the author writes, I'm no gardener, indoors or out, so it consoles me to discover that there can be a third kind of garden for me, the garden of the imagination. Imagination comes into its own in winter. The firelight, the early twilight, and the long nights help us water and feed the garden of our imagination. A former colleague of mine, a farmer's son, was often rebuked if his parents found him reading a book. Haven't you got anything to do, they would ask? Of course, in fact, he was feeding his inner garden in those idle hours. And that garden would bear fruit in later life when he discovered his gift for illustrating books. Mercifully, the pressures to be doing something useful seem to lessen in winter. Hmm. A little meditation you can do is what is growing in the garden of your mind's eye? How are you nourishing it? Hmm. Mm-hmm.